Hey, Dave Williamson, Toy Car Collector here. Check it out. So I come around the corner at the Fred Meyer store this morning, and oh my God, there's a brand new rack. And what's on top of this rack but a buy one, get one free Hot Wheels. Oh my God, this is like a Hot Wheels collector's dream. Can you believe it? A brand new rack. First thing I look at, I look at the rack. Now you're not gonna see anything really cool, really new, except for maybe like this mine car down here right now because I have already been through this rack. I was too excited to hold the camera and go through the rack at the same time. So here's what I did and I do feel a little bit ashamed after taking like all the good cars off this entire rack. But here it is. It's a giant basket of Hot Wheels, which I probably don't really need, but you know, we don't collect them because we need them, do we? We collect them because we want them, that's right. That's right, back to my basket. I was checking my white balance. I don't know what the color is going to look like. But here's the uh, regular rack that they have. And it has a lot of, uh, it has a Hot Wheels uh, Halloween on there right now. I guess that's new for this year. I don't keep up with this stuff online, so I don't know all the details. And that's why I miss the treasure hunts and things like that. But people always point them out to me later. I didn't see anything in the big rack that looked like it could be a treasure hunt. Usually the way I look for it is I look for something that I only see one or two of and then I figure that might possibly be a treasure hunt. Looking at the uh, Hot Wheels for Happy Halloween, I guess that's this year, huh? Nothing really very interesting in that bit, unless you like the decorative cards, which are super cool, of course, decorative cards. And uh, so we got some interesting pieces here that you could possibly collect now. I'm really only into the cars that look like cars, so that's why I have this basket full of cars that look like cars. And But let's keep looking because there might be something in here now. One thing that I found in this huge basket today, or this huge lot today, is that the yellow submarine is out in force in my town right now. And there was no real uh, limit of how many there were in there. There was tons of them in there. See, are we in focus? We are not in focus. There we go. Looking at some matchbox. As I cruise down the aisle here, see if there's anything else. Interesting, any new series? No, I don't see any. Any new multi-packs? Oh, let's take a look at the large multi-packs while we are in here. Oh, let's see, that's the one with the green barracuda in it. Now the green barracuda, the red Ford. Green Barracuda, yellow. I do like this multi-pack with the gray cougar in it. I like the gray cougar, but there really is nothing else in that package to get. So let's see, there's another Green Barracuda and the red Ford. And then here's their standard rack, which there's generally nothing in there. I think I'll tour the, well, no, I think I'm just gonna grab what I got and get the heck out of here before anybody sees me. You know other collectors, if they come in, they might not be too happy that I managed to snag all these cars. But I will show you what I got when I get home. Should probably clear the area as soon as possible. Now I'm looking at their back rack. And the back rack has nothing really on it. They have another stand here, but it's an older one. And I think they just stuffed a bunch of stuff back in here from who knows where. I don't see anything interesting right off the bat now so i'll take this big basket to the cash register and check it out there they are look at those beauties right there look at all these yellow submarines it's crazy i can't believe it look at that there's so much cool stuff i don't even know what this other stuff is i just it just ended up in my basket <laughs> So if you're watching this video and you're not really a Hot Wheels collector, you just go to the store and look at Hot Wheels occasionally, or maybe you don't know anything about Hot Wheels, this bag right here represents the reason why when you go to the store, Hot Wheels seem kind of boring because, you know, collectors come in and they take every single decent car off the rack as soon as they come out and sometimes before, sometimes the employees take them off. Now these are not all like rare or anything like that, but this particular rack did have yellow submarines on it and it is the first yellow submarine that I have seen. I got this thing for 50 cents. Now these 
when they first came out were selling for as much as $25. I've seen them recently in large lots for I think three or four dollars a piece on eBay. But here's 50 cents. So that was really cool. And then I just picked up randomly every other car that I liked. I like these racing cars, the European style racing cars. So I picked up a bunch of those and some Volkswagens. There was some new, like new colors. I think this Camaro is a new color. Pretty cool. I just got so excited I just randomly started grabbing cars off the rack. Volkswagens. Anything that I thought would be good long term to, to have a bunch of. I, I do have an antique mall space, collectible mall, and I put cards in there for two bucks. People like to come in and see some stuff that they haven't seen before and pick it up for two bucks and helps me pay for my mall space, which is where I keep everything that I don't really need and I need to sell, but it's not something I can put online because the price is just not that high. Of course, did I show you the Minecraft car? It's pretty cool. Like all Hot Wheels collectors, I get super excited about any new car that comes out, and I gotta get out like a dozen of them. It's pretty cool. I suppose I'll be making more. I don't know anything about Minecraft, except that it's way super cool, and people love it. So, there's that bag, and I think I'll head to like one more store, and just for the heck of it, and see if I can't find another rack. I found, by the way, a tip for you, I found these yellow submarines, mostly on the lower tiers of the rack that I was looking at. So I think I'll start at the bottom next time if I find another rack. So I'm gonna head out right now, bye. Hey, before I take off here, this is Dave again. And uh, let's see, I think I'll put my sunglasses on. Let's see, I gotta figure out how to hold this camera, like with that hand and do that. You know, everybody online that talks to their camera uses their sunglasses, so maybe I should do that too. Okay, so uh, what I'm doing here is I'm testing out the new Galaxy Note 7 front-facing camera. Is that what you call it when it faces this way, the front-facing camera? Anyway, I think it's an improvement over last year's model, but I didn't have last year's model. I had the year before that's model, which was the Galaxy Note 4. Now, I have the Note 7, which is the phone that's been recalled, but I'm not I'm not sending mine back right now. I want to keep mine. Um, I hope it doesn't catch on fire. I'm pretty sure it won't, and I do really like it, so I'm going to keep it until they can make me another one because I really like it and uh, maybe I'll show you a picture of it later. It's pretty cool. It's got that rolled over screen on the sides which I thought I wouldn't like but I do really like it. So all right now I'm heading to another Fred Meyer store in Portland, the Gateway store which uh, you know I've never really found anything there and of course if I end up there then I'll probably run out to 164th and there goes my morning and man I got a lot of work to do. I have got to get to work. So here we go. Bye. Why do I keep saying bye? I gotta stop saying that. So here we go. Doom. I feel like I need a tone or something to check out. Here we go. All right, I made it to another store. I'm looking at some multi-packs here. Looks like there's a few different cars in there I haven't seen before. Look how messed up the tampo is on that guy. That's really bad. And I see this Firebird. That's pretty neat. It's got green wheels on it. It's kind of weird, but look at that green tampo. It's kind of neat. And uh, that might be different. Isn't that different? I don't know what that is. But that one's kind of a satin black and that one's in a satin gold. Let's see if there's any other changes in there. No. Boy, that's all have bad tampons on them. Look at that. Really bad. And nothing new in there. No, nothing. Hey, here's some I haven't seen before. Peanuts. A peanuts car. Look at that. Oh, that's pretty. Huh. I've never seen this. Never heard of it. Look at that. This one is what? Lucy in an 85 Astro van, which is a drag. It doesn't look like it opens up. Not sure, but it's kind of like a drag bus. These are really kind of cool. Four fifty a piece. Rolling Thunder, Nate, Snoopy, here's another one in the back here, this is neat stuff, look at that, I've never collected these or anything, but this is a custom Chevy Greenbrier Sport Wagon, there are five in this series, oh, the Dodge A100 is the only one missing from this shelf, let's see. No, there is not that one, so maybe that is the hot one. Dodge A150. Should I get these? Those are really pretty. Peanuts, and they're kind of Christmassy and all that. I think I might go ahead and get these, but then I'll have to run around and 
find a set. I don't want this. No. I bought them at the convention. I'd have to carry them home, and they're awfully heavy. So, pretty cool. Okay, I'm now at home in the kitchen, and I have my bag of Hot Wheels booty. That's right. Let's take a look and see what I picked out here at the store. Look at that. This is neat. This is a new 73 BMW 3.0 CSL race car. It looks fantastic. The kind of car that you got to buy several of in order to get the one that looks the best. Definitely. Let's see what else is in this bag. Oh, look at that Minecraft. Got the new black Camaro. I don't think I had that one before. I think it's a new color. Got the GTO. I think that's an older one. I might have had that already. Oh, look at that yellow submarine. Yeah, baby. Loving that. Yellow submarine. Oh, and this Hot Wheels van is super neat. Dodge van, right? Right, right, right. Okay. I'm going to go change my settings on the camera. I think I got some sort of weird color going on. Hang on. Be right back. There are so many settings on this new camera. I was set on retro, and now I'm set on film mode. It's another... Let's see one of those, one of those, one of those, and one of these. All right, let's get back in that bag. All right, hey, a Volkswagen 69 square bag. I do love the new red color. It's fantastic. Another BMW. I don't know. I don't even know what I, what I put in this bag. Oh, I like the 17 Acura NSX. Look at that thing. That is sweet, huh? That is super sweet. I haven't seen that already. Oh, that's sweet. And this charger. Awesome. Nice color, nice color. Very nice. Hey, what about this setting, huh? Monogram. That is weird. Don't use that setting on your phone. Definitely not. Back to normal mode. Let's check it out. Let's keep checking. Got the Camaro, one of those. How'd they get back in the back? Oh, yellow submarine again. And another charger. One to open, one to keep. And look at this. Oh, the 17 Ford GT. Did you see that? Wow, that one's really cool. I can't wait to open that one. That's really cool. Those two definitely I've got to open. Two of those and a charger. Well, I'll put this over here. We got, the, of course, you got the Minecraft car. Several of those. Got to have a few of those. Every kid wants one of those. Got the Ford Escort. I think that one's been around a while. Ford Escort. Yeah, it's nice. Oh, there's. Oh, that's the same one. BMW. I think I might have got too many of those. Oh, there's another one. All right, yellow submarine. You know, this rack, get down to your local store because when they put this rack out, it's going to have yellow submarines and it's going to have, well, actually, you're going to find out in a minute here. Hey, look at that. That is the Mazda Miata MX-5. Pretty nice, huh? Pretty nice. Convertible. Very nice. All right, another, oops, Camaro, got too many of those Camaros, and that one over there, Minecraft, back in the bag, another Minecraft, seems like about the same number of Minecrafts, maybe a few more than there were Yellow Submarines, Yellow Submarine, you know, it's, oh yeah, Minecraft is all over the place right now, so, I got too many of those, I think, Oh, yellow submarine. Okay, so here is the answer to the question. How many yellow submarines are in the new pack and ship the shipper? Is it called a shipper? Is it called a packer? I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got nine. I might have left one behind. I don't think so. But there were about nine yellow submarines in that packer. And they are cool. So, I got them. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got those... One for me, and two for me, and some for all my friends, which will appreciate that. And, oh, that's about it. A few Minecraft. Did you take a good look at the Minecraft? I think we already did that. Let's get over here in the light. Pretty cool. I don't really understand it. My grandson loves the Minecraft. Oh, hey, how about this one? I like this. Mercury Cyclone 69. Pretty cool. I like that one. All right, I think that's about it. Whoa, 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 wait, no, it's not. I keep saying that. 69 Dodge Coronet. Ooh, that's a pretty one. Can't wait to open that. I got so many cars to open. I am never going to get to all of them. There's just so many you can't keep up with. Look at this Ford Shelby GTR 350. 
350T350R, da da da. And that is it, folks. So thanks a lot for tuning in and watching my video, sharing this with me. Tomorrow's video is going to be opening Redline Blister Packs. Come on back and check it out. Thank you now. Bye. Why do I keep saying bye? See you later. I gotta find something else to say. Okay. Um, three, two, one, fade out.